Start recording. Stop recording button. Hello, everybody. It's me, Logan, here. We are going to be looking at a game called Six Swords. Here we go. Alexa, open Six Swords. Welcome to Six Swords. Surrounding you is Prairie. North. You travel north. Around you is Grasslands. There is a castle sisterhood of the local tigers here. You come upon three baboon. Looks like there's going to be a fight. Say fight to fight the next round of combat or run away to flee. Attack. Hadassah hits right. baboon with her hand axe for three damage. Melanie misses Baboon with her hand axe. Moses misses Baboon twice. Hayden kills Baboon. Baboon hits Hadassah two times for two. You have two enemies left. Attack. Hadassah kills Baboon. Melanie hits Baboon for four damage. Moses kills Baboon. The fight is over. You gain 43 experience points. You are in grasslands. YouTube, now, Guava Juice, breaking world record. North. Unfortunately, you come to a large lake and must return the way you came. Alexa, stop. We'll be waiting the next time you want to play. You can meet your fellow players on the website listed in the companion app. Alexa, open the Dark Citadel. Loading the Dark Citadel. Welcome back to the Dark Citadel. Did you know there are in-game items you can purchase with the gold you find in the game world? You can acquire items to help you throughout the game, including healing potions, recharge potions, and more. Say visit the shop to learn more. Your difficulty is set at. Easy. Let's jump into the game. I have no idea what you're talking about, and I need to get back to work. The bartender says, storming off. You hear him muttering something about devil weed addling people's minds as he wanders away. You are all in shock, but it makes a sickening kind of synth sense. You hadn't noticed at first, but things do look and feel different than when you left into the desert. I just sent a link account card to the Alexa app. If you sync this skill you will unlock current and future features. Your choices include, option 1, say 5 months have passed, option 2, stay silent, and option 3, Say, how can this be? Option one. I know. Isabel says, we were only in the desert for about a day or two, but six months passed out here. What horrible magic was affecting us? That isn't the worst of it. William says, shaking his head. Your choices include, option one, ask what he means. Option two, stay silent. Option three, give him a funny look. And option four, head straight to chapter four. Option three. What do you mean? Isabel asks. I mean. William says. That we are, and going to be able to go home. The army has been destroyed, the city is under siege, and a much worse threat looms on the horizon. That concludes chapter three. You have reached a milestone. You found one gold piece and earned 44 experience points. You could strike down your foes much easier with a magic sword. The Dark Citadel menu. Which path would you like to select? Your choices include Option 1, Chapters 1 through 9. Option 2, Chapters 10 and on. Option 3, Player versus Player menu. And Option 4, Change Games. Option 1. Alright, which of the chapter groups would you like to select from? Your choices include Option one. Dice world. Two, now, your roll with mirror. Four through six. Option three. Seven through nine. And option four. Main menu. Option two. Which chapter would you like to select? Your choices include option one. Chapter four. Crisis of faith. And option two. Previous. Option one. All right.
Alright then, let's jump into the fourth chapter on your journey. In chapter 1, you began your journey and escaped the Dark Tower. Chapter 2 saw you locate the Seeker, and in the third chapter you entered the desert and located an evil crystal. When last you left off you were in a tavern resting for the night after your ordeal. You wake up the next morning after exiting the desert and find Prince William and Isabel in the main room of the inn having a heated conversation. The bartender is asleep but there is food on the counter for breakfast. It doesn't look like it has been touched. Your options include, option 1, grab some breakfast, option 2, go and see what they are talking about, and option 3, ask if they need anything to eat. 1. You grab a plate of food before having a seat at the table. We need to find out about this crystal. Isabel says. It is our number one and only priority right now. The prince frowns at her. I will not and cannot abandon my family right now. The gem is important, but I must make sure my family is safe. Your options include, option one, back the prince, option two, back Isabel, and option three, stay out of it. Option one. You support the prince in the decision. The woods are treacherous now and there are many signs of the orc army that has marched through. You pass a number of small outposts that have been long since abandoned, many of which have been burned to the ground. You are forced to move slowly to avoid detection, but after a number of days you arrive near the outskirts of Alderton. The city is entirely surrounded by an encamped army of orcs. Your options include, option one, ask what to do next. Option two, Say you need to sneak into the city. And option three, say you need to break the siege. Option three. And how do you propose we do that? There are only three of us. I know a few back ways inside. As do I mine undoubtedly better. Is that so? It is indeed. I might not have been born with a silver spoon, but I know how to evade detection. Your options include, option one, follow William inside. Option two, follow Isabel inside, and option three, sneak inside on your own. Option one. William leads you to an old break in the wall where he thinks you can get inside. You are spotted by an orc patrol, however, and arrested. You are taken to a cell. That went well, Isabel says with a smirk. At least they didn't take our weapons. They must not consider the humans they capture to be much of a threat. I can see why. Who would be dumb enough to break out of prison surrounded by an army of orcs? Your options include, option one, well, we need to. Option two, say let's wait for nightfall. And option three, let Isabel take the lead. Option two. Sounds good. I could use some rest anyway. That night Isabel picks the lock on the prison and breaks you out, sneaking the three of you to a sewage drain and into the city. Your options include, option one, clever entrance, option two, you have got to be kidding, and option three, no way I'm going in there. Option three. Get in there and plug your nose. I hate this, you know. I just want to throw that out there so everyone knows how much I hate this plan. Quit being a big baby and start crawling. You crawl through the sewage pipe into the city and after what feels like hours you make your way out and onto the streets. The city is locked down tight with guards every few dozen feet. Everything is grim. Your choices include, option one, ask where to now. Option two, say nothing. And option three, what now? Option one. I won't be coming with you into the castle. Isabel tells William. I don't think the king will much appreciate me showing up. And besides, I have business to attend to. Your choices include, option one, ask if she needs help. Option two, go with the prince. And option three, say nothing. Option two. I understand. The prince says, Isabel disappears into the city and you follow William. You follow the prince to the gates of the royal palace. The guards recognize you and rush you upstairs to meet with the king and queen. When you arrive, the queen is furious. Where have you been? Your choices include, option one, stay out of it. And option two, we've discovered something of value. 
Option two. The crew ships you escaping with. I wasn't speaking to you. We went to investigate the corruption. It is much worse than we thought. The king is silent for a long moment. We were afraid you were dead. You cannot keep running off like this. I apologize, but it was necessary. We discovered that the threat is coming from the Dark Citadel. Your choices include option one, add that you went into the desert. Option two, say nothing. And option three, let the prince finish. Option three. We must get you out of the city. Absolutely not. This is our home, and we will not allow a ragtag band of orcs to push us out of it. Your options include option one, say it isn't safe here, and option two, say nothing. Option one. We have enough food for two years should the siege last that long, and the orcs do not have siege weapons built yet. We will be able to hold out for a long time, and reinforcements are on their way from the west. How long? A few months at the most. Your options include, option one, ask how many have died, and option two. Gmail, now, YouTube, Guava Juice just uploaded a video. Guava Juice has uploaded. A few thousand, maybe more. The orcs aren't pressing yet, but rather building up their forces. We should speak with them and attempt a parlay. William says. The king sighs. It is of no use. I sent out an envoy just last week and he was murdered. I received only his head in response. Your options include option one, his head. Option two, the orcs did that. And option three, stay silent. Option three. William seems taken aback by the news. It makes no sense. With the threat they face, they should want our help, not our animosity. William says, Always thinking with your heart, William. You must think with your head. If you will excuse me, I have a strategy meeting to attend to. You should change as well. You smell terrible. With that, the king exits the room. William speaks with his mother for a few minutes before heading outside. Your choices include, option one, follow him. Option two, go and get cleaned up. And option three, stay silent. Option three. I would like to look further into this report. If the orcs indeed killed an envoy, then it must be dealt with. However, I'm not entirely convinced of the story. Even orcs have more honor than that. William says, your choices include option one, I was thinking the same thing. Option two, say nothing. And option three, kill the orcs. I can see them doing it. Option three. Orcs might be brutish, but they are not excessively cruel, nor stupid. We should investigate this report and determine its veracity. William says, your choices include, option one, perfect, but first, food. Option two, great, but I need a nap. Option three, say nothing. And option four, directly into chapter five. Option three. Thus ends chapter four. You could strike down your foes much easier with a magic sword. The Dark Citadel menu. Which path would you like to select? Your options include Option 1, Chapters 1 through 9. Option 2, Chapters 10 and on. Option 3, Player versus Player menu. And Option 4, Change Games. Option 1. Alright, which of the chapter groups would you like to select from? Your options include Option 1. 1 through 3, option 2, 4 through 6, option 3, 7 through 9, and option 4, main menu. Chapter 5. I didn't understand that request. Say next, previous, or repeat to cycle through possible commands. All right, which of the chapter groups would you like to select from? Your choices include option 1, 1 through 3, option 2, 4 through 6, Option 3, 7 through 9. And option 4, main menu. Option 2. Which chapter would you like to select? Your options include option 1, chapter 4, crisis of faith. Option 2, chapter 5, city under siege. And option 3, previous. Chapter 5. Chapter 5 it is. You 
are gathered with Isabel and William in the prince's quarters after sneaking your way into the city. Not to be a diner, but does anyone know how we're going to fix it? Dice World, now, your role with Eric 8168. Your choices include, option one, say not a clue. Option two, maybe find an orc to talk to. And option three, stay silent. Option three. Well... Dice World, now, your role with Eric 8168. Speech off. First, one of us could sneak out and talk to the orcs. Second, one of us could talk to the nobles in the city and see if they know anything about the envoy. And lastly, one of us should talk to the general of the army and see where the battle stands. Isabel shrugs. I'm not talking to any nobility, but I can handle either of the other two. Your choices include option one. Talk to the general. Option two, talk to the nobles. And option three, talk to the orcs. Option three. You all split up and head in opposite directions. Isabel goes to speak with the general, and William goes to the nobles. You must decide how you want to meet with the orcs. Your options include option one, walk out boldly. Option two, sneak out. And option three, go orc hunting. Option three. You decide your best option is to hunt the orcs. Never mind what William says. You sneak back out of the city and start combing the woods, looking for a fight. It doesn't take long to find one. You are now entering combat with two orcs. Say attack or run away or use a special power. What do you want to do now? Attack. You go first. You miss the enemy with your sword. First enemy, the orc missed. Second enemy, the opponent missed. Options include attacking, using special attacks, asking about details for how something works, or running away. What would you like to do now? Attack. You go first. You attack and wound the opponent for 8 points of damage. The orc is doing badly and could use healing. First enemy, the orc struck you for 13 points of damage. You have 34 out of 47 hit points left. Second enemy, the opponent hit you for 12 points of damage. You are doing badly and could use healing. Say use quick attack to use your special power. What do you want to try next? Attack. You go first. You slash with your sword and hit the opponent for 8 points of damage. The orc collapses and is dead. You found one gold piece and earned 41 experience points. You are still in combat with one orc. The opponent attacked and hit you for 11 points of damage. You are close to death. Say attack to swing at the enemy, check your health, or check your enemy's health. What will you do next? Attack. The enemy goes first. The orc missed. <laughs> You attack and crit the orc for 14 points of damage. The orc is close to death. Say attack or run away or use a special power. What do you want to do now? Uh, attack. You go first. You attack with your sword and crit the enemy for 16 points of damage. The orc collapses to the ground and is dead. You found three gold pieces and earned 27 experience points. Hurrah, you leveled up. You are now level 6. Your stats will be updated at llitd.com on the Dark Citadel leaderboard. You strike the orcs down. You could strike down your foes much easier with a magic sword. You have unlocked a new power you can use. Your choices include feint, parry, lethal attack, and lunge. Perry. Perry has been added to your character sheet. You can use it an unlimited number of times. You hear more orcs coming. Your options include option one, stay and fight, and option two, head back into the city. Option one. You engage the orcs. You are now entering combat with four orcs. Oh, jeez. Stay attack or run away or use a special power. What do you want to do now? Attack. 
You go first. You miss the opponent with your sword. First enemy, the enemy missed. Second enemy, the orc missed you with its great sword. Third enemy, the opponent hit you for 14 points of damage. You are fairly well off. Fourth enemy, the orc hit you for 15 points of damage. You have 23 out of 52 hit points left. Options include attacking, using special attacks, asking about details for how something works, or running away. What would you like to do now? Attack. Attack. You go first. You slash and hit the orc for 12 points of damage. First enemy, the opponent missed. Second enemy, the orc hit you for 13 points of damage. You have 10 out of 52 hit points left. Third enemy, the orc struck you for 10 points of damage. Four gold pieces go rolling free and disappear. You have no healing potions available. Dang it. You collapse to the ground in a heap as the world fades to black. No! The dark citadel menu. Which path would you like to select? Your choices include option 1, chapters 1 through 9. Option 2, chapters 10 and on. Option 3, player versus player menu. And option 4, change games. Option 1. All right, which of the chapter groups would you like to select from? Your options include option 1, 1 through 3, option 2, 4 through 6, option 3, 7 through 9, and option 4, main menu. Option 2. Which chapter would you like to select? Your choices include option 1, chapter 4, crisis of faith, option 2, <coughs> chapter 5, city under siege, and option three, previous. Option two. Chapter five it is. You are gathered with Isabel and William in the prince's quarters after sneaking your way into the city. Not to be a downer, but does anyone know how we're going to figure out what happened to the envoy? Isabel asks. Your choices include option one, say not a clue. Option two, Maybe find an orc to talk to. And option three, stay silent. Option two. I think that will be more difficult than we might know. Well, we need to do something. Both of your companions seem at a loss for what we all should do next. <coughs> there are a couple of options we could try. First, one of us could sneak out and talk to the orcs. Second, one of us could talk to the nobles in the city and see if they know anything about the envoy. And lastly, one of us should talk to the general of the army and see where the battle stands. Isabel shrugs. I'm not talking to any nobility, but I can handle either of the other Alexa, two. Alexa, stop. All right, thanks for using the Dark Citadel. Reviews Speech on. Stop recording button. Please 